ever trash the locker room? Dr. Crabblesnitch says you're a troublemaker. You had it, Con. Are you hurting yet? Backup's arrived. Good? Howdy! Ah, hello class. The curriculum demands that you do these vocabulary uh, assignments. Why don't you finish them here in class? That way you'll have more free time. That's right! Keep it up! Good show! Well done. Good one. That's right. Try again, James. Keep it up. Good show. Good one. That's right. Well done. Keep it up. That's right! Oh, you remind me of myself at your age. So full of hope, so full of vigor. Russell, smash, stupid face! Don't pick on me. Scar's face! I kick it! My work here is done.
You seem to be making yourself quite comfortable here, my boy. I'm just trying to fit in. By fighting? By making a nuisance of yourself? That is not the Bullworth way, boy. Yeah, you could have fooled me. What? I said you could have fooled me. This place is full of bullies and maniacs. Nonsense. That's just school spirit. Hijinks. Why, in my day, we felt nothing of castrating the new boys. I want you to stop this nonsense, Hopkins. I want you to behave yourself. You might learn something. Fine. Can I go now, sir? On your way. Hey, I saw you sucking up to Crabble Snitch. What? Shut up. Screw you, new kid. This is what we do to teachers' pets around here. You better not. Ow! <laughs> come here, you little. Yeah, come and get me. <laughs> what you gonna do? Sorted. Ah, 
carbonation. 100% pure artificial flavor. So that's a good idea, right? Yeah, okay, all right, sure, I'll do it. <laughs> hey man, what's going on? Not much. I was just telling Petey here about my idea to take over the school. I mean, my plan for us to take over the school. What plan? Don't worry, Jimmy. It's just a little something I came up with. It's sink or swim, my friend. And if you're good at swimming, you gotta let the losers drown. Why don't you guys leave the thinking up to me? What? What? What, what the? Can't you say anything else? <laughs> you know what, Petey, you were right. Jimmy is pretty dumb. What'd you say about me? Whoa, nothing, no, no, no. All I said was that you had to be pretty dumb to get expelled from so many schools, that's all. <laughs> Relax, James. All he said was that you must be dumb. Or maybe you're all messed up because you came from a broken home. What'd you say about me, dwarf? Come on, dude, chill. No, 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 no. Gary's taking everything out of context, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't lie, Petey. Don't you lie. Because you know what happens to liars? No, no, I'm not lying. We kick them in the balls! <laughs> Come on, Jimmy, let's go see how good you are with this new slingshot I heard you had. Don't worry, friend, nothing escapes my notice. I hear everything. You and me, we can do things. Jimmy, this way. Hey, see if you can knock out the windows in that bus. I want to see your long-range skill. See if you can get him with your slingshot. You do have some talent. All right. Come on, let's go down to the football field. There we go. Done.
Go on, Petey. Go cry to the teacher. Tell them I was nasty to you. Shut up, Gary. You're such a jerk, man. Oh, am I, Petey? Oh, you're so cutting. I'm really upset. Actually, I think I'm gonna go cry. Then I'd be just like you. Cry, little girl. Oh, look out. <laughs> Here comes Jimmy. Just knock it off, Gary. You're out of line. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was hanging out in the girls' dorm. Silly me. Shut up, man. You're boring. Boring? I'm boring. You're none too interesting yourself, friend. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, both of you. I apologize, okay? I just get a little overexcited. Forgive me. Forget it. It's cool. Anyway, I've got a good idea for some fun. Let's go out and torment someone really helpless and unfortunate. That homeless guy. <laughs> come on. You coming, little Petey? Come on, I'm sorry. I'll give you a kiss if that's what you want. Shut up. Then come on. This is gonna be fun. Harassing some old homeless guy is fun? It is. You're and you should be grateful you're not the victim for once. I guess. Hey, Jimmy, tell me about this guy. Does he like to go in his own pants? Where is this dirty old perv? You know, you're not very nice, Gary. And you're a loser, Petey. One of life's unfortunates. Get out no. of here, you little oh. scum! <laughs> <laughs> so I guess the rumors are true, Jimmy. Your dad does live Shut on campus. Up. You jerk! Ow! Let's leave this guy to his welfare payments. Come on, let's get out of here. Just get out of here, kid. Why should I? Because otherwise I'll kill you. What's your problem? <laughs> That's a long story. You got any liquor? No, I'm 15. Well, what about drugs? No. Then why shouldn't I kill you? All right then, tough guy, kill me. <laughs> you know what, kid? I like your style. You got guts. When I was on that ridge in Korea, watching my buddies get killed by friendly fire, I could have used somebody like you. Yeah? Thanks. But I bet you can't fight. You do me a favor, and I'll show you some real moves. Classified moves. Real special army stuff. Cool. Just get me a part for my radio, and I'll show you what the army taught me. What, like how to get shot by your own side? Exactly. Get it, 
job. <laughs> Kid, you're one of the good ones. I learned this one from this crazy guy I served with. Okay, he was my cousin. You're doing me better. You know you're all right, kid. Don't forget to bring me a transistor when you come back. I said I'd do it. Hey. 